It's tilt number eight, and it's Steve, Swerving Steve Rose. <laughs> 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 but don't tell Norman and the new Tony. Okay. To be fair, Are you ready? Well, I'm ready. Yeah. Um, number one, primarily occurring in the first half of the 20th century. What name was given to the controversial laws in the southern United States? Chris and Michael together. No, sorry, sorry, my mistake. Chris, on your own. Prohibition? No. Uh, have you finished the question? No, I've not finished the question. Well, yeah. That's Michael. not bad. Yeah. Jim Crow? Yeah. Michael? Yeah. Jim Crow? Yeah, you've got it. Yeah. I've never got a pretty good son of anarchy. Number two, which controversial British American journalist who died in 2011? Richard said Christopher Hitchens. Yes. No, 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 no. That's best known. <coughs> Go. A quick one here. What is the longest river in Canada? Mackenzie? Number four. Hang on. I did ask that, give the question, the question back at the end of my answer then. You heard it. Go on. Um, Dennis Healy died in, on October the 3rd, 2015. Which other former chancellor? Ashton. Jeffrey Hart. Yeah. Died six days later. <clears throat> Number five. The eyes of Dr. T.J. Eckelberg. Clive. Uh, Great Gatsby. Yes. <laughs> How? Just go through that for us, will you, please? He was, he was on um, one of these billboards. It's like a recurrent thing. Oh, that's right. Yes, it was a recurrent thing, wasn't it? I was going to go for Gary Gilmer. <laughs> In which sport is the swiveling <laughs> Norman. Table tennis. Yes. Great answer, man. Good press as well. That was bravery. <laughs> The, you ready? Yeah. Yeah. Um, the lady doth protest too much, methinks. A quote from which Shakespeare. Hamlet. Um, which country shares its western border with Romania and its eastern border with the Ukraine? Michael. Moldova. The TV programme, Last of the Summer Wine, what was Compost's surname? Preston. It's uh, sub salmon, salmon White. See your call. What's that again? It, 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 it's Simon White, Simon White, Simon White, however you want to pronounce it. Yeah, I think that's Simon White. Simon White, however you want to pronounce it. I can spell it for you, I think. Yeah, it's close enough. Matt, it's close enough. Shut up. Number 10. Um, which legend of British of the British pop world died on the 8th of March 2016. Warmsley. March. Oh, it's March too early. Oh, um, don't know. A uh, kid? A uh, David Bowie? No. 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 Uh, Press of February. Yeah, yeah. I was going to say Bowie. Who was going to say Bowie? Chris? I was going to say Michael? Yeah. Ashton? George Martin? Yes. Oh, 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 what was the pen name of the author of The Adventures of Pinocchio? Lost it. One flip. Carol Colody. Yeah. Uh, no. Go on. Yeah. Um, the 1967 British comedy film, A Countess from Hong Kong. Five. Joe Chaplin. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Number 
Go. The outside is just fine. Then. Thirteen you've had. Yeah. Um, who was the only president succeeded by another president with the same initials? Another? Madison. Oh, 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 yeah. Oh, yeah. Madison and Monroe. Madison. Yeah. Yeah. Madison and Monroe, yeah. Go on. I'll just check on that. One, two, three, four, five, six, eight, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. You've had fourteen. Um, number 15 then, um, who was the first woman elected to the House of Commons? I mean, it wasn't Nancy Ashton, Michael. Markovic. Yeah, she didn't take a seat, did she? Oh. Yeah, so. What was George Eliot's first novel? <laughs> Middle on the floss. Oh, Walmsley, sorry. Mill on the floss. It's not Mill on the floss. Uh, Kit, uh, middle not match. Fi not finished either, sir. Oh, oh. right. That Walmsley, oh. minus one. Oh, all these short questions to now. <laughs> <laughs> right, go on. What was George Eliot's? Oh, oh, yeah, sorry, Ashton. Felix Holt? No. Preston? Uh, middle March, I was going to say. No. no. That was a loud one. Uh, Norman? Daniel Deronga. No. These are all still minus ones. Are they? Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, the guess. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, no, no. Go, carry on, carry on. Yeah. What was George Eliot's first novel inspired by her aunt's preaching in Worksworth? That's Clive. Adam Bede. Yeah. Clive's on his half century. Um, who played Professor Fate's assistant Max in The Great Escape? Clive. Charles Bronson. No. Walsley. Terry Thomas. No. Kid. Uh, James Garner. <laughs> Laycock. Pleasant. No. Preston. Gordon Jackson. No. <coughs> yes. Uh, John Lane. Yeah, we can't any, any, any more. Mm. Peter Falk. Mm. Tell me that was your final question. <laughs> no. oh. I remember that's one that you know we've got, so that's one to add to the total. Didn't know that, man. Yeah. Mm. Um, You've got three to go. Yeah. Oh no, four to go. By 15, 18, 19, 20. By population, what is the largest island on earth? <laughs> Well, <laughs> Australia, but... No. Yeah. Not in any... Yeah. Uh, Norman. Java. Yes. Yeah. 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 Would you accept it kind of Eurasian? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> That's not my age, right? Um, now, better remembered for an acting role, later in life, in a classic BBC sitcom, the best known work of which prolific playwright? Walmsley. Well, it's the ghost of Alan Ridley. Alan Ridley, ghost of But I'm saying it with a yeah, good answer. Alan. Good answer. Tell me Walmsley. In 1893, what did James and Robert Hoskins call their new blend of merino wool and cotton? which has since become a well-known brand name. Laycock. Harris Tweed. No. Chris. No, sorry. Walsley. Terrily. No. Ashton. Angora. No. Michael. Cashmere. Can you, can you turn that down, Steve? Yeah, sure. <laughs> Who's next after Michael? Uh, Richard Fred. Rio. No. Preston. Walk. No. Velvet. No, so I think that's one. Viella. Viella. Okay. Uh, it, we, we do another one to go, aren't we now? So, keep your eye on your scores. Jack off. You all ready? Yeah. Okay.
I'm looking for a US state. The first motel in the world was opened in this state in the town of San Luis Obispo. It's called Michael, California. Yeah. Some questions as well. I've been to that town. Have you had time? Yes. Okay. No prisoners. Okay. Which novel features the characters Arabella Allen, Rachel Wardle, Job Trotter, Sergeant Busfuss? <laughs> Five Pickwick Papers. Okay, who was the captain of the England women's football team during the 2015 World Cup? Norman. Charlotte Edwards. Cricket, she's cricket. Have you finished the question? Oh. Yeah. Uh, Michael? Stoney? No. Rose? Steph Houghton. Steph Houghton. Mm. Yes, right. Okay, question of science. What's the name of the large, sorry, what's the name of the Hadron Collider's largest particle detector? It shares a name with a character from Greek mythology who was the son of a... Rose? Higgs Boson. Can I just uh, yeah. do you on this place? Can't hear it though. Go on. Think, think okay, so the name of the, so the name of the Hadron Collider's largest particle detector. It shares a name with a character from Greek mythology who was the son of Iapetus in Clymene. Norman? Cyclops. No. Hello. His children included the Hesperides, Hyades, and Pleiades. The name is also given to the topmost vertebrae and with the axis with and with the axis five. That was nice. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm looking for an artist. He died in 1614 and he was associated with the art style of mannerism. His famous pins include the disrobing of Christ, the burial of Norman. El Greco. El Greco. Oh, oh, Norman's oh, kind of getting <laughs> bloody pain in the neck. Go on. Okay. <clears throat> According to the Gospel of St. Matthew, who had four brothers called James, Joseph, Simon, and Judas? Uh, Peter. Sorry? Peter. No. Chris? Joseph? No. Lecott? Daniel? No. Ashton? Judas? No. Richardson? Paul? No. Michael? Lazarus? No. Preston? Mark? No. <laughs> Rhodes? No. Jesus. Yeah. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. 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 Well, as soon as they were all younger brothers, right? Say Matthew. Sorry. Well, as soon as they were all younger brothers. Yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah. 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 Say that with the gospel, Saint Matthew. It's all there. It's gospel. Yeah, it's gospel. Right. <laughs> it's gospel truth. <laughs> okay, I'm looking for a country now. It was an annexed by Austria-Hungary in 1908. It proclaimed independence in 1992. It's Chris, Slovenia? No. Its second largest city is Banja Luka. Michael? Bosnia? Bosnia. Go on. <coughs> What's the name of the 2015 US TV series starring David Duchovny as an earlier PD detective? Second. Chris, California No. 2015. Yes. In 2015 US TV series starring David Duchovny as an LAPD detective set in 1967 and featuring Gavin Anthony as Charles Manson. It shares its name with a British arts programme from the 1970s and a sign of the Zodiac. Chris. Alright. How about the answer? Uh, five, sorry. Queries. Queries. Okay, I'm looking for the name of a royal family. A member. A, a, a name, name of a royal family. The first Bulgarian king from this family was Ferdinand I in 1887. The first Portuguese king was Peter V in 1837. The first Belgian king was Leopold I in 1837. The first British monarch was Edward VII. Clive. Is that school? Is that cool? yeah. Question. Okay. In 1994, this band changed their name from Rocket Ruby Dolls to their current name. Their name was inspired by the lead singer's arts teacher. 
Their first self-titled EP was released in May 1998 on the Dangerous label. Their second EP, Muscle Museum, reached number three on the EP charts. First, Muse? Muse, yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, this is just a short one. Which European country was the first neutral country to recognise American independence? Uh, Switzerland. No. Rose. Belgium. No. Tesco. Norway. No. Lake of Sweden. Sweden. Ah. But who is the only American football team to have a perfect season? Rhodes. No. Rhodes. Pittsburgh Steel. No. Uh, Preston. My uh, man, the Dolphins. Man, the Dolphins. Two centimeters. Yeah. Yeah. So, uh, yeah. Rhodes yeah. loses one. Preston yeah. gets two. Okay, I'm looking for the name of a character from Philemon Literature. He was played in the 1911 film by Henry Krauss. In the 1997 TV film by, sorry, in the 1997 TV film by Mandy Patinkin. In the 1956 film by Anthony Quinn. His voice was provided... Clive, Tim Bud Yeah. Kid? Zorba? No. Minus one of each. His voice was provided in the 1996 animated film version by Tom Puss. He was most famously played in the 1939 film by Charles Lawton. Ashton. Zorro? Sorry? Zorro? No. Norman? No. Uh, yeah. Okay, what connects the following? Go. What connects the following? Artemisia, The Plains of Ellis. Apollo, Alexandria, Ephesus, Rhodes, the sites of the seven wonders of the world. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Not the seven wonders of the world. Okay, what's the, the name world? of the Belfast studios where Games of, Game of Thrones is made? <laughs> it's gone for that. <laughs> I'm not even going to bother. The, the Titanic studios. Is somebody buzzed there? Yeah, the Titanic studios. Yeah. yeah. Okay. The first woman to win this prize was Bertha von Suttner. Five. Double press literature. No. Ashton. Nobel Prize for Peace. Yeah. Go on. Yeah. Okay, I'm looking for the name of an operetta. The principal characters include Gabriel von Eisenstein, his wife Rosalind, and her maid Adele. It was based on a play by the German playwright Julius Roderich Bendix. It was composed by Johann Strauss the Younger and translated into English as the Bat. Love. Die Lady House, No. Yeah, Freedom House. Freedom House, yeah. Freedom House. Yellow by Coldplay was played over the open credits of this film. The film features the childhood and adolescence of the character Mason Evans Jr., played by Ella Coltrane. His sister Samantha is played by the daughter of the film's director. Ashley. Boyhood. Good okay. What's the better known name of the painting? The shooting company of Franz Van Michael Nightwatch. Okay, what forename is shared by David Jason's character in Touch of Frost? One of the four American presidents to be assassinated. Jane Bester? No. Richardson? Jack. No. Abraham? No. no. Oh, well, I'll go on number four, Norman. William. William. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> it's a similar elimination. That's what it was. Right, now we're going to 50 50 on it. Right, so Preston minus one. Richardson minus one. Kid plus two. And Norman plus two. Okay, Tony. Oh, no. I still think I only asked 19, but. <laughs> Where we go? Okay, the last three, three, three flow by. And uh, the last three question setters, we're going to start with Chris. And, uh, well, good luck, everybody. Knock yourself out. Here we go. Okay. What is the name of the BBC educational programme which aired during the 80s and 90s? which was predominantly centred around the humanities subjects. It's got its name... Richardson. Bite size? No. Minus one. 
Preston. Zigzag. Yes. Zigzag. Zig oh, yes. Very good. 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 Off you go. Okay. Fever to Tell is the debut album of which American trio which reached number 13 in the UK album charts. Songs featured on the album are Date with a Night, Pin and Y Control. The lead singer is Karen O. Walmsley. Can you third? Oh, call them again. Michael. Oh, I forgot that now. Uh, you finished? Yes. I can't remember uh, Ashton. Dixie Chicks? No. That's exactly what I was going to say, so I've, got, I've not got an answer. Kid. Uh, Rose. Liberty X. No. Go on. The yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. The British could call the yeah, yeah, as well, isn't it? Yeah, 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 I think. So no, they're American. Both with Jack and Hattie. Uh, they're not, um, from London, the guy was. Oh, sure. Yeah, yeah, yes. No, can't be. Anyway, carry on, please. Uh, which footballer has played in the Premier League for Everton, Liverpool, and Middlesbrough? During his spell at Middlesbrough, this Portuguese international had a plan. Michael. Apple Xavier. Yes. Yeah. Who knows if there's been a little bit of a connection with yeah. the last few uh, What is the name of the first motorway service station to open on? Oh, Laycock. Orford Gap. Correct. Oh, useful two points. <laughs> okay. Which English rugby union international player of Nigerian descent? <laughs> Ashley? Victor Abugu? No. Go on. Oh, Richardson. Chris Afili? No. Oh, Rhodes. He told you. No. Preston. Is it Monye? Correct. Yeah, go Monye. You go, go Monye. The city sounds never impressive. <laughs> Which, which band collaborated with Emma Bunton for the cover version of Walmsley? Tintin Out. Correct. <laughs> band. Michael was not far behind then. He was Rose. Yeah. Okay. Torvald and Dean famously danced to Ravel's Bolero at the 1980s. Rose. Sorry. No. Ashton. Walmsley, Van. No. Can they are. At the 1984 Sarajevo Olympics. Ten years later at Lillehammer, which instrumental version of the song? Michael. Let's face the music and dance. Correct. Oh, no. Are they all mine songs, by the way? Yeah. 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 Go on. Okay. What is the name of the digital TV station which launched in 1998 and closed in 2002? During the daytime, it broadcasted mostly music videos, and in the evening, it showed original comedy and reruns of BBC comedy series. The TV station gave David Williams and Matt Lucas a big break with Rock Profile, and Mitchell and Webb were also given their first sketch show two years before they began work on Peep Show. Ashton? UK TV Gold? No. Um, I think. Um Yeah. No. It was we could have our UK play or play UK. UK play. Yeah. Okay. What is the name of the condiment used in Argentina, mainly for grilled meat? Its ingredients include parsley, garlic, oregano, oil and chili flakes. And in folklore, the name originated from English slayers, sailors saying gimme curry and was lost in translation. Okay. Lake Oak. Chimagri? Sorry? Chimagri? I'll give you a good one. It's chimichurri for the pronunciation. Three people on four. Okay. 
Yeah. What was the biggest selling single on the UK charts in 1982? 1982. Eye of the Tiger Survivor, correct. Oh! Well, oh, well, oh, 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 work it out. Well, well, best two out of the day. Well, not really. If you know your list from each year, it's just a recall. Yeah, nothing. It's not your best out of the That's why I had to give it another second to click in now. Carry on. I'm very good at it. I'm impressed. Thank you. <coughs> Only Connect presenter Victoria Corrin Mitchell is also an accomplished professional coach. Oh. Oh. Richardson. Oh, and I'm Richardson and Rhodes together. Could you whisper an answer to the person next to you? I was going to say, but, uh, yeah. uh, I, I presume they're both wrong. Are you conceding them? Yes. Richardson, Poker. 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 Rhodes. Not poker. You're not the poker. Right. 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 Debs. Uh, Alan Connell. No. <laughs> Preston. <laughs> the ETP Tecton Holden London winner of about half a million quid. Longsley. No. <laughs> Jazz, <laughs> Jazz Horn. No. <laughs> Laycock. Two time European poker tour. No. Listen. Oh, listen. Listen. Do? listen. <laughs> yeah, go on. Okay. She's also an accomplished professional poker player. She was the first person in history to become a two-time European poker <laughs> tour. Her first success was at EPT London in 2006, but in which resort was her second EPT victory oh. in 2014? Oh no, I thought you'd finished. Uh, we've got to go for um, counts. No. Minus one. You went not to finish it. Uh, no, no, no. I thought you finished. I thought you finished. No. Oh, Michael, you've got something as well. Yes, I thought you finished. 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 Five? No, I'm going to eat me. Ashley, sorry. Sanchez, sorry. No. Uh, no. Anti. Sorry? Anti. No. I've got lost the point. Five? No, no, no. Oh, no, Clive cunningly waited. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I waited, Liam. Yeah, it's five. Is that everyone? Yeah. Sam Rio? Sam Rio. Sam Rio. Sam Rio. The last few didn't lose any points there, didn't they? I know. Okay. Who was the only Englishman to manage the Cyprus national football team? This person was born in Heaven Tyneside and started his football career at Darlington, who then moved on to Manchester United. After winning two Division I championship medals and surviving the Munich air disaster. Michael? Poppy Chong? No. Carry on. Oh, Rhodes? Jack Charlton? No. Carry on. After winning two Division I championship medals and surviving the Munich air disaster, this goalkeeper signed for Huddersfield. Five. Frank Swift. No. Oh, oh. oh. Frank. Walmsley. Good for. Uh, the song. Um, uh, um, oh, 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 I'm giving you a different no. answer. Uh, Preston. As soon as it's a goalkeeper, I would say Frank Swift. No. Oh, well. uh, uh, Preston, you're all right as well. Uh, I can't, we can't let you have that. If you say something <laughs> else, we, you know, you're not me. <laughs> I'd answer me and then you all start talking about What do you want to say? What did you want to say? Hey, oh. What were you going to say? Harry Gregg, what his name was. No. Harry. Right, so you're out anyway. Yes. So <laughs> let's have a look who's. Uh, do I owe a Matt Preston a minus one? Yeah, 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 I get one of points. I think I've given you it. It's a uh, Ashton. Are you standing? No. So, uh, we're good. Yeah, so this goalkeeper signed for Huddersfield in 1958 and finished his career after spells at Bradford and Barnsley. Don't continue this fucking question anymore now. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Bert Chapman. No. <laughs> Is that everyone? Yeah, yeah, yeah. we want to go, I think. It's Ray Wood. Would it? Good question. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Go on. Traditionally made from clay or ceramic, what is the name of the wind instrument which is estimated to... Laycock. Ocarina? Correct. Oh, oh I just that. so was... Thank you, Zelda. <laughs> Here comes the pony. 
What shared title was a number seven hit for Sailor in 1975? <laughs> girls, girls, girls. Correct. What we call it very well. Go. Wait, just give me a second. Okay. What name is shared by a Greek god, the world record breaking tallest dog of all time? A Trojan horse computer virus, and a wrestler who headlined No Holds Barred in 1989. Michael, Zeus. Correct. Yes. 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 Michael, Freddie Spall. Oh, correct. I can't be that far behind. Because... No, you weren't that oh. far behind. Frederick, Frederick Fowl. Frederick, yeah. Mm -hmm. Get it off the chart, Michael. What is the name of the most populous island of the Channel Islands? Rhodes. Jersey. No. You can swerve. Uh, Walsley. Guernsey. No. Michael. Sark. No. Kiss. Lock. Road minus one. Walsley minus one. Michael minus one. And uh, kid. Yeah. Good job. Yeah. So the most populous island of the Channel Islands of California, located 22 miles due west of Los Angeles. It was once the home of Marilyn Monroe. Five. Santa Monica? No. Ashley. Catalina? Yes. Oh, so we oh, 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 well, we can't complain about that too much, can we? Honestly, no, 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 yeah. no, no. In the kind of uh, stop vein, I like it. Into, first person was going to get right if it was. Exactly, yeah. yeah. Okay, what was the name of the British film released in 2000, which centres around two jolly teenagers whose ultimate ambition is to have season tickets at some point? Like on, are you purely better? Purely better, like, I think this is the last one. Um, outnumbers, oh, sorry, outnumbered Tiger Drew Honey, who's going to be out. Question. It's got to be the chest which you bend over. Correct. <laughs> yes. <laughs> and there was a question which I didn't understand an answer which I didn't comprehend he, 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 and I am totally on the canvas here. Look, right? look it up on the end. Look it up on the end. Just put bend over in the search engine. Yeah. <laughs> okay, we are going straight on to Mark Preston's yes. ultimate tilt. Jump first in a tilt. <laughs> <laughs> well we have got uh, <laughs> Michael McPartner is now going to lead by two points in the uh, gross competition. <coughs> Mark Preston, you are in the lead. Oh, 63 yeah, for the money. In second place for the money, Ashton Davis. Didn't make the headway there, Ashton. What happened? Michael McPartland, you're also in contention for some money as well today. It will be a, a nice guess. Well found. What, what, what could you do with that? Okay, uh, by the way, please. Uh, I'm I'd like to say my questions uh, uh, may fall short of the quality from earlier this afternoon. Well, I'm going to say thank goodness for that. <laughs> Are we ready, guys? Let's finish cheap and cheerful. Come on. Are we all set? Uh -huh. Right, good luck. 20 questions coming your way. Come on, Steve. What is the name of the Panamanian law firm which currently are in the. Rose. Yeah. I'm too slow. Uh, one foot. So one second. Front. Front and second. Nope. Norman. Moussak Fonseca. Yeah, I'll tell you. Moussak and Moussak Fonseca. Yeah, Moussak Fonseca. Number two. What was the name of the 33 to 1 winner of the Grand National? Which <laughs> Richardson. Rule the world. Rule the world, correct, tell me, yeah. Which organisation, founded in December 1865 by six former members of the Confederate Army? Michael, KKK. 
Correct, Matt, yeah. Good answer. Good answer. Well, did I finish that question then? That was it, yeah, for, yeah, that was it. Yeah. David Bedford Forest. That's, that's why nobody dare buzz in, because we don't have to go through the questions. They're not that twisted this time. They're not that twisted. You finish yeah. on a bloody comment, eh? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> 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 what Latin word is given to the left hand page of a book of. Lovely. Verso. Verso's correct. Right. Okay. No. Yes. Looking for a number. How many republics make up the former Soviet Union? Rose? 14. No. Walmsley? 15. It's correct. Oh, well, that's a good answer. Uh, former, yeah. former republics make up the former Soviet Union. Number of counties each player that start with backgammon. The atomic number for phosphorus. And the shirt number for the current Middlesbrough FC player, Alex Baptiste. Well, that would have nailed it for me. That's <laughs> what. <laughs> it, just a bit of old, we've never field. seen them all season. We wouldn't have got that. Exactly. I wouldn't have got it. No way. And I've got to be a bloody match. There you go. He's on loan somewhere at the moment. Yeah. Oh, is he? Yeah. Well, he broke his leg. Broke his leg straight away. Is that the ex Blackpool left leg? Yeah. Like, yeah. Hey, come on. For the one in the conversation with the cut, we want to have a conversation with the cut shot. Okay, moving on. <laughs> Currently in the news. Facing possible impeachment proceedings. <laughs> oh, we've got Laycock going in. Brazil. It's correct. Oh! Yes. I didn't know what you want to The next word would be Dilma Dilma Rousseff. Is the second current 36th president of which country? Brazil. <laughs> Get in there, man, Laycock. Good answer. Yeah. Is that Steve? Yeah. Should we send me that? Which tea growing region of India? <laughs> Richardson. Assam. No, lose a point. Oh, I remember it. Wormsley. Well, that was my answer. I said Darjeeling. It's correct. As a Hindi name, meaning the land of the thunderbolt. It was, I was born in the sand. Well, I'm not going to say you can't get because you've got that. I'm really glad Tony got that there. With regard to motoring registration, for what purpose was the typeface Charles Wright 2001 designed? It was designed for number plates. Correct, Steve, yeah. It's the font number plate to make. The motorway box were designed in the mid 60s. Yeah. Charles so. Wright 2001 is the font of car registration plates. Set? Yeah. Who was the last native Welshman to hold the title Prince of Wales? Norman. Llewellyn. Nope. It's Kid. Uh, Owen Gwendoa. Correct. That's it. Owen, Owen Gwendoa. And Kid stands at the crease, a hat trick. It is mercy. Still on all things Welsh, who was the first Welsh actor to win an Oscar? Kid. Richard Burton. Nope. Uh, Not Burton. What was it? That's a real land. It's correct. That's a real land. Lost Weekend 1945. And Grit Spins all time. What film? <coughs> Lost Weekend. Brilliant film. I've not seen it. I've got to watch it. It's in the best years of our life. It's, it's, like about, it's about an alcoholic author. What could be better than that? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right, 11. Amna Hall. A M N E R. Am <laughs> Whoa, Norman. Duke and Duchess of Cambridge. Is correct. Incorrect. Oh, well. oh, right, there's a few witchy trigger fingers oh, coming up here now. I did actually stumble to give it a spell. So, Amna Hall, home to the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge, is located within which larger Crown Estate? We will go for. Oh, shut up, Steve. The winning Norfolk. Well, who's next? Walmsley. Sandringham. It's correct, so it's under the meetings. Hang on, Steve. Oh, it was, Steve. it was. It, sorry, my mistake, Chris. I was going to say something. Yeah. Okay, you got it. You can see that. Yeah, yeah. Ooh, right. Ooh, ooh, did, ooh. I, did I put the points on Tom? No, me. I didn't think it was going to be Right, okay. we we'll put Chris down for two points there. Controversy reigns. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not on that. Okay. Which fortified wine is produced wholly on the Italian island? Lake 
Marsala. It's correct, Mark. Mm -hmm. Holy produced on the Italian island of Sicily. Go. In 2015, causing quite a stir at the time, which London museum rejected the fact... Michael, b &A. Correct, Michael, B&A, yeah. yeah. What's the Absolutely, sorry, number. Rejected the Thatcher's family offer to display oh, yeah. memorabilia belonging to the former Prime Minister. Yeah. Take your hand and shoot your hand. Well, very good choice <laughs> by the V&A. We, we know you'll turn it down. Yeah. Yeah. Turn it, once you turn it down, it's basically... Yeah. Ready, Steve? Yeah. I'll let you swig that in case you're getting in quick. Yeah. Uncle. From which country did Cameroon gain independence in... Not France. It's correct. Gained independence in 1960. I what? remember the Haile Selassie Festival in Cameroon. Right, okay, up to question, moving on swiftly. Up to question 15. What was the name of David Barry's final album released two days after his death? Oh. What was it? Oh, it was, it was Lazarus, but... No, Lazarus. incorrect. It's end of question, don't lose a point for you. Guess everybody. Michael. Black Star. Good answer, Michael. Yeah, good answer. That's, 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 that's a single, wasn't it? Yeah. yeah. 16. Which element on the periodic table is the lowest numbered element to begin with a vowel? Oxygen. Correct. Eight. Oxygen. Yeah. Eight. I'll take that one. Thank you. <laughs> on the symbol lines, which London underground tube line comes first alphabetically? Central. Nope. Uh, Next. Uh, Bakerloo. Bakerloo. Ah, good one. Bakerloo is correct. I was still trying to think something in the air. You don't know, see? We good. Which soft drink formulated by pharmacist Charles Alden? Lake up. Seven up. Nope. Lose a point. Rhodes. Dr. It's correct. Oh, Dr. Pepper. It's always Dr. Pepper. Uh, Pharmacy Charles Olson in Waco, Texas was first marketed nationally in 1904. Thanks, Dave. <laughs> okay, two questions to go. The Limehouse Declaration. Is it? Richard said STP. It's correct, Tony, yeah, good. good you said de 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 issued on the you did say declaration. <laughs> yeah, the <laughs> Line House Declaration, <laughs> issued on the 25th of Jan 1981, effectively launched which UK mm -hmm. political party? Oh. And the last question from me Who is the only dragon to have appeared in every scene? Norman. Peter Jones. It's correct. Uh, to appear in every series of Dragon's Death, Peter Jones.